What's up guys, it's Salvaje and we're back at it again with another Boruto episode review. So I just want to cover this real quick because every time I have to address this I'm actually wasting some of your precious time and I'm very very sorry about that but I just want to address it one last time, right? Every single week I have at least one very ignorant person that goes into the comment sections and just gets very very tilted because I said this and that about the Boruto anime because I shared my opinion. All right, because I shared what I liked and disliked about the episode and you know he goes on to be a very delicate person like oh my god I'm so butthurt that you criticize just this one thing about the episode You're like all those people that hate on the Boruto anime listen guys if you ever see Some of those motherfuckers just tell them to shut the fuck up All right, cuz I'm really really tired of wasting my time with those people I'm gonna say it one last time when everybody was hating on the Boruto anime, all right, including the big YouTubers like Suakage who do, who do Boruto episode reviews, when everybody was hating on Boruto, I was the one that was actually defending it. And last but not least, every point that all of these YouTubers, big YouTubers make about the Boruto anime, I made those points before them. All right? Like, for example, the point that Boruto is a brand new anime and you shouldn't really take a look at Naruto and compare it with Naruto. Okay, I made that point long ass time ago, and now is when YouTubers are actually starting to make those points. Okay, also, last but not least, guys, let me just get one thing out of the way. If I need, if something happens in the Boruto anime, yes, I'm going to compare it to the Naruto anime, because what the hell am I supposed to compare it to? What other anime am I supposed to compare it to? High School DxD? What the fuck do boobs have to do with ninjas? Okay, uh, what else am I going to compare it to? Food Wars? What the hell does food have to do with Boruto? Alright guys, <laughs> seriously! If I want to compare something in the Boruto anime, guess what anime I'm going to look at? Naruto! Okay, now that we got that out of the way, let's just get started with this, you know, Boruto episode review. Again, man, I I I'm just so tired of these people, so if you guys ever see one of these people, just tell them to shut the fuck up, alright? You got my permission. Anyways, I actually like this episode. But I honestly, I, I also just disliked it, right? Honestly, I felt like this episode was kind of just... Honestly, kind of just useless. I feel like they could have easily made this episode into five minutes. And then the graduation uh, episode would start off. And then uh, basically the, the graduation episode would be sort of like a build-up type episode. But I guess they decided to make this episode the build-up type episode. And then the graduation video is hopefully not going to be a build-up. Because two build-up episodes in a row, as you guys know, that's something that I don't like. Okay? But of course, it is just my opinion. I like big boobs. I mean, I like big booties. Okay, and uh, I actually don't really care about big boobs. Some of you guys, you know, might think differently. Again, it's called an opinion. Just, just, we just need to educate a couple of people on that. You guys know what I mean, because it's the internet. But anyways, with that said, though, even though I didn't really think this episode was a big deal, okay, be mainly because you know Boruto was just completely undecisive between the episode, and at the end of the episode, I basically was like, okay, Boruto, so what? You're gonna follow everybody around? You, you didn't really give me a straight answer here, right? And I, of course, I definitely think that was also the point of the writers. They weren't gonna give us a straight answer on what Boruto was going to do because they wanted to keep us wondering. That was actually done really well. Again, it's just something that I didn't really like that much about the episode. Anyways, uh, but yeah, like I was saying, even though I didn't really like uh, you know, the episode that much, there was actually a lot of things in the episode that I really, really liked. Like, for example, the fact that Kakashi was in his uh, disguise uh, on the reporter. We actually saw that disguise in uh, the Naruto episode, I believe, where Kakashi actually shows his true face. Pretty, pretty cool thing, you know, kind of like an easter egg for, uh, you know, crazy Naruto fans. And the crazy thing is, guys, that I was like, man, where have I seen that reporter before, right? And then at the end of the episode where Kakashi takes off his mask, I was like, holy shit, that's right. That's like the little outfit, I believe, that he put on when, uh, you know, he showed his mask at the end of the episode. So, yeah, I think that was actually pretty, pretty cool. Uh, other than that, another thing that I, of course, liked about the episode is how Boruto just inspired Sarada out of nowhere. Uh, I think that's pretty cool, and I'm actually really looking forward to seeing how Sarada and Boruto are, of course, going to get along once they, of course, uh, do, uh, you know, join up the team and stuff. Another thing that I also liked about this episode is the fact that next week we're actually getting the graduation episode, which is something that, you know, I've been looking forward to a lot. Uh, honestly, I do hope that this uh, graduation exams arc doesn't really take that much, and maybe we can, you know, go on a couple of missions or so. I really don't know what arc we're going to be getting after this graduation arc, because in my opinion, you know, some people say, oh no, you know, missions are going to happen, shit like that. I mean, yeah, it's definitely possible, but 
in my opinion, after this graduation arc, we're going to get that uh, Momoshiki arc. Okay, uh, but basically that means that the tuning exams are going to be closed. But guys, they can always do a time skip. You know, just like they did with Naruto. Okay, the Naruto season, literally after three seasons, because the fourth season was basically filler. Uh, but after three seasons, they did a time skip. Okay, and I mean, they haven't really done three seasons of Boruto. But again, I'm just saying, it's, it's a possibility that we might get the Momoshiki arc after this arc. Keep in mind, I don't really, uh, you know, keep up with the manga, so, yeah, I'm, I'm probably very, very wrong on that. Anyways, guys, uh, that's pretty much it for my Boruto episode review for episode 35. Look, man, overall, I think the writers did a good job on this episode. This episode just wasn't for me. That's that's just, just a straight-up answer, honestly. Uh, and, and, and again, you know, that's, that's, the, that's the reason why I'm just telling you guys to just shut these people up and just constantly complain about people's criticism on the Boruto episode like these people expect you to like every single Boruto episode like these people expect you to like waffles just because they like waffles all right what if I don't like waffles what if I like pancakes I actually like pancakes and waffles both of them at the same time I hope you guys enjoyed this Boruto episode review, and uh, I really hope I don't have to shut anyone up in the comment sections this week. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed the episode, I mean the video, make sure to drop it a like. And uh, guys, only one more week and we get to see that graduation. I'm looking forward to it. Anyways, see you guys in the next one, and peace out, boys.